Member for Sariko Overdale. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, last month, I attended the Buddhist Bihara Society, known as BBS property, that is in my riding. Uh, they asked how they could better support local community events, including a food bank, senior services, and other community activities in the Cloverdale Port Cowles area. I met with the BVS Assistant Treasurer, Iraj Lianej, to learn about the society and the history of the seven acres of farmland in the Port Cowles area. Picture, if you will, a long driveway, and at the end of the driveway is a barn. Next to it is a two-story house and a temple that's off to the side. Lining the driveway on the right are many planter boxes where the congregation plants and harvests vegetables throughout the year. They spoke how they could prep food on the site and take it to the Cloverdale Community Kitchen, where they use their kitchen to cook the food and then deliver to the less fortunate in individual meals. I was pleased to inform the BBS and the Cloverdale Community Kitchen also had a food bank. Instantly, we started talking about the possibility of helping out the local community and how BVS could possibly produce vegetables and fruits for their congregation and for the Cloverdale Food Bank. We instantly began a conversation regarding the possibility of constructing greenhouses at the rear of the barn. And that's where the stumbling block came forward. Halfway, there's a stream that divides the property, three and a half acres on one side, three and a half acres on the other side. And the lands on the other side haven't been in production for many years. Accessing the uh, back of the property would be a huge asset to the production of fruits and vegetables. Well, Mr. Speaker, I can tell you that talks between BVS and the city have begun. BVS will now need to determine what kind of engineering is required to access the rear of the property. Metaphorically speaking, the bridge at the back of the property will be the bridge to BVS providing fresh fruits and vegetables to those in need. It will also be the bridge to food security. I hope to report back to the House in the near future to share the next chapter of BVS.